Hello everyone, welcome you all to my video, in this video. We will look at the installation steps involved in installing a pretty popular custom ROM called Lineage OS. Before we proceed further, make sure your phone bootloader is already unlocked. If you don't know what is bootloader and what is root then watch this video by clicking the i button. If you have not yet subscribed my channel, then please do subscribe now and also press the bell icon to stay connected with my upcoming video. First of all, we have to download Lineage OS from the official site. From here choose your device brand and device model, that are listed in this list. From here download the latest zip package. Now, connect the device to the computer using a USB cable. Now, use the ADB push command to copy the file to the SD card, and unplug the cable once done. You can also drag and drop by opening the device in Windows Explorer on your system. Now, switch off your device and boot it into the recovery mode by pressing the volume up, home, and power button simultaneously. Now, you will see the TWRP screen. Now from here. Select the wipe option from the menu. Now, swipe to factory reset which clears the cache, data, and delve it VM. You should see the factory reset complete successful message as shown on my screen. Click the back button and select install. Select the downloaded lineage OS zip file. Once you select the ROM, the following screen will be displayed. Now click on swipe to confirm flash to begin the flashing process of the custom ROM. Once the installation is complete, you will see the zip install complete message as shown on my screen. Click on reboot system to reboot the phone. Once the device starts, you should see the Lineage OS screen. You will then see the usual Android system, set it up according to your liking. If you like to use Google Apps then you to download them from OpenG Apps, and then install them using TWRP. But I am not want to use them, so ignore them. First of all turn on the developer option from settings and then turn on the USB debugging along with root privileges. Run ADB devices to get the information of connected devices. Now check if you can log in as a root user by typing adb shell and then su command. But, here you see, su is inaccessible or not found. This problem is common with all lineage OS. To fix this we have to root our device again with the help of the magisk manager. Go to their official site and download the APK file. Once the file downloaded, install it. Now go back to the downloaded folder. Now rename the Magisk Manager to zip and save it. Now, switch off your device and boot it into the recovery mode by pressing the volume up, home, and power button simultaneously. From here click on install and select the Magisk zip file and flash it. Now reboot the system. Now, connect to the device from the system using a USB cable, and check if you can log in as a root user, or not.
There is a special feature that comes pre-installed with Lineage OS, which is ADB over the internet. Enable the feature. Now connect with the device using ADB Connect. If you have any doubts and queries about my video, write me below in my comment section.